Hello everyone, I'm going to walk you through the wild flight level here in the Spyro the Dragon. Now this is a fairly tricky one and I'm going to have the map on the bottom left corner open so you can see the path I'm taking. Now there's also a trophy called I believe it's time for me to fly if you complete wild flight without touching the ground. So I'm going to go after the gold chest here first, that first one in that first area and then these two in the tunnel, followed by a, another one and a plane. I'm going to get simultaneously there another chest and another one now there's two more gold chests i'm gonna leave them because i'm gonna go uh clockwise around this as the planes are heading towards me as i come out i'll grab the last two gold chests now i'm gonna do another circle where the planes are coming into me around here and i'm gonna head back down that same path once i kill the final plane right here so this is the exact same path i took in so i'm gonna come back out now i'm gonna just go clock or counterclockwise around this area going through the arches and shooting the boats as I pass them. Now I'm gonna have a choice between the arch and the boat. Always take the boat because the arch don't move. Grab a few more arches here, and then I'm gonna go and continue behind the boats here. And we're about to start our second lap around here. Got to turn here and go down this path. So lap two starts here. Again, I'm gonna have a choice between an arch and a boat. So I'm gonna choose the boat. I only have one boat and an arch left. Swing back around, grab that final arch. So yeah, about 20 seconds left there. That was my route. Uh, you can repeat it if you'd like. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you didn't touch the ground, you'll get yourself a trophy. Thanks for watching. See you soon.